Shankar, uh, Your Excellencies, uh, ladies and gentlemen, first of all, my deep appreciation for your being here uh, this evening. Uh, CEW has uh, a very ambitious uh, program, as you've just heard, from Suresh and from uh, Arunaba, and our board, which is quite small actually, and uh, uh, is really uh, very, very engaged and thrilled that we could engage uh, not just with all of you, but you know, with the country uh, in how we can integrate these ideas. And I was particularly pleased that uh, Shankar talked about the economic levers uh, in strategy uh, today uh, in a geopolitical sense. And I think that uh, we uh, have to appreciate that uh, our economic uh, development and growth is to a very, very large extent going to be depend on the way that uh, our programs and strategies on energy uh, and water and the environment play out. I think that uh, you know, the, the connection with, for instance, health and how uh, health uh, costs and health uh, and well-being of our society is really going to get impacted by, this, uh, pr by these programs is, I think, very, very critical. Uh, I was talking to some of the very uh, eminent uh, doctors in Bombay a few days ago and they were telling me that the number of cases of cancer that they are now seeing has grown 10 times compared to just a few years ago. And I think that uh, these externalities uh, of these type of uh, very, very critical issues are going to really determine uh, our well-being and our economic development to a very, very large extent. And I think that uh, all the studies uh, have shown how energy access uh, and access to water and sanitation you know, really makes a huge difference in economic development. So I, I really appreciate uh, your uh, approach that it is these uh, very, very crucial and critical issues that is going to determine our economic future and our well-being. And I personally believe very, very strongly that uh, there is a huge opportunity for us to look at renewables. You know, India has uh, a huge potential in wind, a huge potential in solar, a huge potential in bio uh, wastes which can be used for energy, etc. And I think that the integration of all these issues uh, is very, very crucial. Uh, I was very struck a few days ago to read about uh, the future of food and uh, the, food, the future of how food uh, security and the quality of food is going to play a huge part in the future. So I think that these are, you know, for you, Shankar, I think from a security point of view, uh, in the broader sense as you have laid out, very, very crucial for all of us. So thank you very much for your thoughts this, uh, this evening. Really appreciate that. Uh, you know, we are so thrilled that Suresh Prabhu has, uh, is chairing uh, this initiative because his experience, uh, you know, not just as being Minister for Environment, Energy and, and, and all industry, etc., but that his engagement in these issues is so strong. Uh, I think that uh, we are really very, very fortunate uh, to have you, Suresh. So thank you very much for everything that you are doing for this. And I think uh, Arunaba has, uh, you know, in this very, very short period of two years, has really raised uh, the research and intellectual profile of CEW to a very, very great extent. So Arunaba, really, uh, really appreciate uh, your efforts in this. And I think that it has been uh, uh, a, very, uh, a very big journey in a very short time. And we look forward to uh, uh, you know, working uh, with all of you uh, to engage in these uh, very, very crucial issues. So thanks. Yeah, that's right. And we really do want to appreciate. Would you like the whole team to stand up, the CEW team? Please do stand up. So from one person running CEW, we now have a very, very young and uh, 
uh, engaged team and uh, all praise to you Arunaba for putting all this together. And finally, uh, I hope you do enjoy this evening. Uh, please do uh, be very engaged with each other and with us and we look forward to doing this uh, over and over again with you. Thank you.